What's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to another Minecraft video and today it's gonna be more mods versus maps Hope you guys are ready for some destruction because this one is gonna be awesome We're gonna be blowing up the hillside manor you might have seen it on planet Minecraft And honestly, I assumed it was just the manor until I downloaded it I've seen this map like a hundred times and today I looked around and noticed it's a giant map There's floating castles a water slide a pyramid and so much more so we need a serious explosive mod for this one, and it's going to be more explosives. We got a bazooka, lava bombs, we got nukes. It's going to be crazy. And if you're new to the channel, guys, be sure to hit that subscribe button, because we do this every week, and it's always a lot of fun. And let's shoot for 6,000 likes this time. That would be amazing. But I guess it is time to get started. And I did want to say total respect to the map creator. This map is completely awesome, so we kind of got to blow it up. I got no choice. It's amazing, so it needs to be blown up. And I've been wondering, what are you doing over here, villager? Did you fall off? If you have a good trade, I'm not going to blow you up. But if you have a horrible one, you're probably going to get something really bad. All right, let's see. Iron pickaxe, two emeralds for silk touch. That's not that bad. All right, I'll let you live for now. Maybe they kicked you out because your trade was too good. So this, guys, is the hillside manor. Really cool structure. And I think we got to start with some blasting caps. I like to start with the weaker stuff because I could nuke this, but then there'd be nothing left and be a little boring, you know? We wouldn't even be able to check out the build, and a lot of this stuff, they put a lot of effort into building. So we're going to take a bunch of blasting caps, and we're going to put them around here. Hope you're going to be okay, cow. You're not a chicken, so you might not survive. What is with all these villagers in the water? You're swimming? They, they kind of have a pool. All right, so that should be enough for our first explosion. So all we need to do is grab the blasting cap detonator. Right click. Set this to zero, I believe. And detonate. There we go. The manor is kind of injured. He's trying to get back in the house. Do you need help? I'll try to blow up that wall without killing you. All right, can you get in now? You can get in, sort of. All right, there you go. I saved your life, sort of. What do you got for trade? All right, that, that's a bad trade. Catch that. What the hell was that? <laughs> Just jumped down from the freaking ceiling there. All right, guys. So let's get some more blasting caps and some bombs. And let's blow this manor up. And then we'll check around the map a bit. All right, so this should be perfect. This hallway is going to be very unhappy. Because if you didn't know, hallways can be unhappy. Okay, so let's put them here. There's like signs all over the place now. I knocked so much stuff on the ground. All right, so we'll set it to zero and detonate this. I think we need bombs. The blasting caps just don't do enough damage. With the bombs, you can kind of just spam them like this. And if I spam them like crazy, everything is gone. Oh, I wonder if that dude survived from before. Probably not. Why are there so many villagers here? I'm feeling bad. Normally, there aren't so many casualties when we do this. Usually, it's just a map, not so many villagers. All right, so a couple more bombs. Let's at least destroy this with the weaker stuff. And then we'll go on to some epic things. All right, so you know what? I got to do it. I got to do it. C4 on the ceiling. Let's get a couple. And finally, a TNT explosion. Let's get both of them going at the same time. It's going to be perfect. But you can see the manor is no more. I swear I killed another villager. All right, let's try the bundled C4. So this one, if you haven't seen it before, what it does, it turns... What are you looking at it like that for? It, you should really not do that. You're going you're to find out why in a second. Yeah, you got to run. As far away as possible. As I was saying, that's what it does. It turns into a bunch of C4, blowing up everything. Wow. The, the poor custom trees. They put so much effort into the trees, and now they're broken. All right, so I think we took care of the manor. It looks pretty good. We got some nice destruction. Maybe just one more bundled C4 at the top, and that should do it. And then we'll check out the rest of the map. And you can even see, like, a floating island in the distance over there. I right, do it. I love that. It's hard not to love that. All right, bye, Manor. You were a cool build. All right, so I think we got to go to the floating castle. Do we really have a choice on that? I don't think so. So I'm going to take... What should we get here, guys? The lava bomb. And I did want to point out, there's a couple other explosives in this mod. Like, there's some missiles, but they do the same thing as the TNT, but take, like, ten times as long. So we're not going to be using those. We're just going to use the normal TNT versions. All right, so lava bomb. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of villagers around here. This is awful. All right, lava bomb. I think it just puts like a billion lava. Oh, move, move. Oh, God, even I'm stuck in it. I tried to warn you. Run. You have one second. One second. Run. Don't stare at it. You know what? He he wasn't that smart, so 
that's what happens. That that's a really cool thing of lava though. All the villagers have no idea what to do. There's even children around. So you know what? I gotta teach a lesson here. Don't play with explosives. That's bad. You know what we can do here? This is really stupid. I'm gonna take a pressure plate and see if they'll walk onto it and start it themselves. Alright, so see what they do. Don't step on it, guys. It would be a mistake. I think I think we need a little bit more. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, he hit it! He got freaked out from the rain, and that's what happens. Now they're dancing on it. It's not something to dance about. It really isn't. Alright, well, you're dead, and so is your village and everything, and it's horribly raining, which I'm gonna turn off. So, guys, I turned off the rain because it gets a little bit annoying, and it's harder to see in the video while we're blowing everything up. But I think it might be time for it. It might be time for a nuke. And I think the little mini floating castle's gotta be the one to go. Should we check it out first? Wanna put the nuke in the middle? Where does this go? Quick exit. You just jump out into the water. I like that. Alright, so what we're gonna do is talk. That's not the right thing, Pat. What the hell are you doing? This is a nuke. The other thing, does that look like a nuke? I don't think so. Alright, so let me get rid of this pressure plate. I didn't kill them. They killed themselves, guys. Don't blame me. They're a bunch of villager killers. That's not me, clearly. All right, let's get out of here and get a good view of this blowing up. Oh, my God. I didn't even hear an explosion noise. I just saw everything disintegrate. So, yeah, not only did we get the castle, we got everything. We got the ground, we get the water. It's amazing. It's like a meteor hit this. And you can see the water slide. I think it might go through here. I noticed the water slide was so epic. And guys, if you want to see me actually play through it, just like ride the water slide through this map, I might consider doing a video on that. Because I know I did some roller coaster maps and they were a lot of fun, so that might be fun as well. Alright, so should we finish this up here? Should we just nuke it again? We already nuked one. Let's nuke another. Let's do it. Let's blow this up and say goodbye to this whole island. And then we'll go over there. I wonder if that villager is going to survive. I'm thinking no. Oh my god. Oh my god, the villager, he's falling, and I think he disappeared, or... I think he went out of place, actually. He was too far away. And just died. So yeah, guys, all the way down to bedrock here, there's... There's just nothing good. Nothing good. I saw some zombies. A lot of ore, actually. So I'm pretty sure we took out this area. We didn't really miss a thing. Okay, so where was that? Which way should we go? Oh, that's a really cool tree. A really cool tree. Do we go to the tree or over there? I'm thinking the tree. I feel like there's so many cool things in this map. Like giant tree houses. I don't know if it's a house or not. It might just be a tree. If it's only a tree and there's 500 of them, I think I'm only going to blow up one. Because it's not really... A, it's a build, but there's nothing to look at. Just some branches. Alright, so this is what we can do. I think... I'm, sh I'm not 100% sure how this works. Let me get rid of the nuke for now, and let me throw down normal C4. I'm going to blow this up. Then we're going to try to shoot it with a bazooka. I think it's going to work that way. I think whatever you use lasts, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm going to put them close to each other. All right, don't do the nuke. If you do the nuke, it's going to be crazy. All right, there we go. Let's do a bunch. All right, perfect. Say goodbye to the tree, guys. That is so sick. We can get rid of the entire tree. In like 10 seconds. Alright, I did it. I did it. More trees. Okay. This is kind of obsessive. I think you guys would be doing the same thing right now. You'd be doing the same thing. And this is going to get rid of everything. I'm just glad this doesn't cause any lag. That is so epic. Not to worry, guys. I got back to this structure. And I'm going to try to put the bundled C4 on top. And then I'm going to try to shoot it with a bazooka. I really hope that works. Okay, so this should get rid of most of it probably. Or it's all going to fall in the water and do absolutely nothing. Alright, well I got rid of the top. What is in here anyway? Alright, we got to check this out real quick. An emerald. Got an emerald, a diamond. Not really too much. Okay, so if I shoot this, what's it going to shoot out? Normal C4. Let me get rid of that. I want the. There we go, the bundled one. So I can shoot these like crazy. It's going to be amazing. Bundled C4 is going to blow everything up. All right, come on. We got to get this like in the place. You can't miss if it's in the stairwell. It's impossible. All right, that should do it. Say goodbye. I actually got the bottom of the entire thing already. All right, that did it. We got rid of it. Okay, so I see something over here. 
I'm not sure what direction to go in with this. There's like a village. Get some bundled C4. And just toss it in here. Honestly, that, that might get rid of the whole thing. You, you guys live down here? Okay, maybe not anymore. What's going on, guys? You having a bad day? I'm gonna let you live. I, I didn't mean to do anything bad, but if you have a... If this dude has a bad trade... A written book... Okay, fine. That's fine. I'm gonna let you guys live. Have fun. I'm sure you'll have fun rebuilding all this. Alright, so let's see. Which direction to head in here? I feel like whichever way we go, there's something cool. So I'm gonna go through this really interesting lava thing. I'm pretty sure the water slide actually shoots through this. There isn't too much to blow up here, but it definitely leads to some cool stuff. Oh, I think this is where the water slide starts. Alright, so let me get the bazooka, and we're going to shoot some of these bundled C4s. And I'm going to save the nukes for big structures. I think there's one over there anyway. Alright, you going to blow up? You did blow up. Alright, here we go, guys. Let's blow this entire thing up. This is going to be amazing. Yeah, I think the problem is it's, like, made of water. But definitely the ground will never be the same again. And what is this under here? What is this? Oh my god, that is really crazy looking. I don't think we could really destroy this, but we could try. Actually, we need a nuke. I think the only way to get rid of this is with a nuke. Alright, so let me take this, guys, and we'll try to blow this up. I, I really don't know what's going to happen here. So let me get rid of that torch, get my flint and steel, and we'll see what is left of this really freaky looking area. Oh my god. Oh my god. I think it worked, guys. I think it worked. Now, that is insane. That was so much cooler than I thought it was going to be. There's a little bit left, but... Oh, all the sand is falling down now. That is just crazy. Alright, so let's see. Where are we? The floating island is right there, but there's also a giant building, and I think we need to nuke that. Oh, this little building survived. Any villagers around? Probably not. I mean, the villagers today really aren't liking me. I mean, recently... I did that mod where we killed all the villagers, and now I'm, like, blowing up 7 million to them. It, it only seems fitting. Alright, so let's see. What's going on, villager? I'm sure you're gonna be okay. I'm sure it'll be fine. Alright, so, is this just not loading in? Whoa, that is scary. Alright, so what I'm gonna do, guys, is go right into the middle, and I think we could take out this entire thing. I think the entire thing in one go. This is the block for it. This one right here, it's gonna do the whole thing. Alright, so I'm just gonna put down a nuke and we're gonna say goodbye to it forever. Alright, let me get out of here. I need a good view. And we'll see what happens. I think we did it, guys. That is an amazing crater. Alright, so the building is gone. Is is there ground here? Oh, that's the void. That is the void. Don't ever do that. That is so scary. Yeah, we have gotten rid of that building. There is not one trace of it. I see like, I don't even know what this is on the side here. Should I just, you know, bundle some stuff and, and finish this off? Probably. Honestly, I don't think I have a choice. Okay, so that should take care of that easily. Just heard someone come out of a door. Well, uh, I don't think there's any doors left, guys. Just throwing that out there. Don't think there's any doors. Okay, so let's see. I know there's a floating structure we passed a minute ago. It's got to be in this direction. That looks so sick. It's like a giant hole out of the world now. Okay, I think it was over here. It had to have been. Not to worry, guys. I have spotted the giant island. And it looks pretty epic. Take a look at this. It's like the island is sucked out of the ground and into the air. It's kind of cool. So I guess we really don't have any choice but to nuke this thing. Once we nuke it, there's, there's not going to be anything left, probably. Nothing can survive the nuke from this mod. So we'll back up and say goodbye to the island. You know, give it a little wave goodbye. And there'll be not even one leaf left. Alright, there we go, guys. That did it. It looks a little bit weird because of the water. But it is gone. Let's see what's left in this map. I think I have to explore around a little bit to see what we haven't blown up. This we haven't. Alright, so that should probably take care of it. Some of it's got to land on the land and not in the water. Freak it, destroy it, do something. Okay, it worked. So, guys, I'm just going to look around and see what we haven't killed yet. Alright guys, so there's a couple cool structures over here. I think I could just blow them with the bundled C4 with my bazooka from here. It's probably going to do it, I'd imagine. See what happens. Come on. It didn't get the whole thing. Oh yeah, it did. Sort of. Did anyone survive? Any 
survivors in here. You know, we haven't used the lava bomb too much. It's like a weird explosion. That's why I don't use it too often. But let's go with it and finish this place off. And I think I learned my lesson. Don't stand near it. Don't stand near lava. That's really bad. Hopefully the villagers learned that too. So around here, guys, I know the pyramid is in that direction. Let's see, is there anything in the middle here? I don't think so. It's just like fenced off. There's a building right there. You can get rid of that. And then I saw some stuff here too. You see like there's more like buildings in the distance. I like shot way too many things at the same time. All right, let's see. So yeah, there's definitely some buildings over here. Let's try to get a little bit closer. I feel like there's so many different towns in these areas. The poor villagers. They made these majestic towns and now this happens. You know, it, it was fate. It was fate. They built it way too cool. And when you build something too cool, then I come to it and, and blow it up. Now it's actually raining C4 right now. So it looks like more giant trees. I don't think there's too much to do with those because they're not that exciting. Just a big tree. Checking around here. And I know in the opposite direction is where the pyramid is. So we'll watch that blow up. I don't think I'm ever going to get sick of that. Honestly, guys, I might have saved the coolest part for last. You can see the pyramid over there. There's like a structure inside the mountain and even a couple temples. So we got to take a nuke and see what it can do. Honestly, the nuke is so powerful. If I put it in the middle, it might take everything out in one go. So I'm going to place it down right here and we'll see what happens. And guys, I did want to point out, I can't do like five nukes at the same time. It would definitely crash anyone's Minecraft. And that's the last thing I want to happen right now. Oh my god, all of a sudden I thought it wasn't working and then I went down a little bit and every single thing disappeared. Looks like some of it survived though. The pyramids over here, we got, um, I kind of just got everything in the middle. That is a giant crater though. So the villagers are okay, they got the cool little temples over here. So I'm gonna toss down, actually you know what, why don't we just use the bundled C4 and finish this place off. But we gotta use a ton, like a million of it, a million bundled C4. All right, so guys, do you think that's enough, or do you think we need more? All right, so that that should be fine. Let me just get a couple more. All right, that should do it. I swear, that's like almost as much destruction as the nuke when you shoot it out like that. It's still falling from the sky. And there is not much left. All right, so, wow. That just looks so cool. Okay, so we got the pyramid over here in another, like, structure that I can just shoot C4 into. And that'll probably take care of it. Is that an end portal in the middle? I think there's an end portal in the middle of it. Oh my god, look at the sand. The sand is flying everywhere. That is so cool. Oh, the whole thing is collapsing. The whole thing is collapsing. I got like the worst lag spike there. But this is what happened. So yeah, all the sand fell down. That looks really weird, doesn't it? Like what the hell? The portal thing is like... Floating in the air, there's sand on top of it. Looks kind of strange, but we do have this pyramid left. Let's just finish it off. And then we'll check out the map and see if there's anything left. There's a beacon on top, too. All right, so will the beacon survive? Will it survive? There's one C4 right next to it. All right, the beacon is gone. Oh, there was like obsidian underneath this place, too. All right, guys, so I took a look around and didn't see much left. So what we're going to do is just blow up this. I think a nuke is going to do it. It's probably going to. And then there won't be any lava or water. We'll see what happens. This is going to be the last explosion. So let's make it epic. And here we go. And then the whole map is completely gone at this point. Oh, my God. <laughs> Did you see the cows just fall from the sky? All right, so, yeah, that got rid of it. There was a way, and that is how it's done. You can see this water slide like goes through the whole map. It's definitely very cool. And yeah, guys, that is about all there is to show for today. Hope you enjoyed the video and the commentary. If you did, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I will see you next time for another Minecraft video. What's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to another Minecraft video. And today it's going to be more mods versus maps. And the build we're going to be destroying today is the Imperial City. It's one of the most downloaded Minecraft maps of all time. And I can tell why. It's so detailed and just amazing looking. Check this place out. It's actually huge too, so I don't even want to know how long it took them to create this. 
But guys, we've had a lot of requests for me to use the Pandora's Box mod to destroy a map, and that is exactly what we're going to try to do today. And if you haven't seen this mod before, you kind of just open the chest and something random will happen. It's really similar to the Lucky Block mod, except some very huge, strange things happen, like the terrain can get completely ruined. We'll see, it should be a lot of fun. If anything, the map is going to be really, really messy. Like snow everywhere, snow golems, all kinds of weird stuff. So guys, if you want to see more videos like this, be sure to smash that like button. Let's go for 6,000 once again, and that would be amazing. And before I start, I do want to say total respect to the map creator on this. It's really an amazing map. But yeah, it's going to be fun to destroy. So let's go in here, actually. Wow, this place is just so detailed. It's like an elephant over there. All right, guys, so the first box. We put it down. And there's actually a brand new animation for it. Right click, and something is going to happen. I hope it's cool. It's going to be something so stupid, isn't it? It's a, it's a bunch of bats. Is that all you could do to destroy the map is spawn bats on top of each other? Feels wrong. So yeah, there's a lot of different things that can happen, guys. It might destroy everything, or it might spawn in bats. Ooh, something's happening. It definitely changed the ground, and we got a bunch of creepers now. Like I said, it's probably going to make this map extremely messy. All right, let's go for it again. Something cool. And I would use a bunch at the same time, but this is actually one of the laggier mods I've ever seen before. And if you do like five at the same time, and they're all like terrain changing like this, it could be a massive lag spike. That's actually cool. It's, it's definitely going to burn this place down. There's like lava underneath this. Oh my god. Yeah, that's not good. The map is finally taking a beating. So I'm going to kind of just place these things all over the place and hopefully we'll wreck this castle. And I don't think we can take out the entire map because it's bigger than the New York City map we destroyed. It's like never ending. Oh my god, TNT. This is perfect. There's like a creeper right next to that. That is exactly what I was hoping for. So as you can see, guys, this can destroy a map in many weird, strange ways. Things are already changing. The terrain is, is looking weird over there. Now I'm going to get like a wooden hoe. I can just feel that. Your cats... What is going on? What happened from that one? I don't see anything, but I have a feeling something must have happened. Oh, the bats just burn in the fire. That must have been what that noise was. You can do this. You, you're giving me lots of materials. Lots and lots of materials. That's not going to help me. I don't need to get wood right now, no matter how weird that sounds. Anyways, let's take one of these. Put it there. Let's try two, actually. I'm so tempted. Do something amazing. The cool thing about this is we get to see some awesome stuff happen and some funny stuff. I think we're turning into the end. Oh my god, the whole place is turning into the end now. It's changing all the blocks around us. So like these structures completely changed. I consider that some kind of destruction. It's lagging a bit because I think that the whole castle is like turning into the end. Look, all the blocks are like changing in front of our eyes. That That is ridiculous. Oh my god, the whole place. It's never going to be the same. Alright guys, I'm calling that a win for this area. I think we took care of it. Something happened to it. It's extremely messy now. Like, wow. Even the ceiling. Across the entire thing. So let's get out of here and try to wreck some other areas. Alright, here we go guys. And this is what it looks like from the outside. We actually changed some of it. Alright, let's go to the other side and see what we can do here. Definitely an interesting choice for this. I figured I had to switch it up. I know we use a lot of the same mods, so today, Pandora's box. Oh, there's a cat. There's a cat. What are you doing? I can feel something's gonna happen. Something awesome. Just, just the facts. I feel like I'm in front of an enchantment table right now. Come on, you gotta do something cool. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. You're lasting a really long time. I hope that means something, and not that you're, like, broken. Should we just open up another one next to it? Oh! Do you see the tree just disappeared? What did you do to the tree? I'm trying to see if it's like making things disappear. I got a bunch of cats following me. Right, let's try it again. One more. We'll go with two. Double the chance of something awesome happening. Please don't hit my cats with the arrows. Oh, that is weird. That is really weird. It grew like an end tree on top of an... It's like a jungle end tree. They're growing everywhere. And it's like raining blocks. That is so strange. They're actually going on top of the building now. Oh, how far does this extend? 
as you can see, they even added some stranger stuff because I reviewed this right when they updated it and I never saw this before. They've definitely changed it a lot. Such a crazy mod. So guys, what we're going to do is just spend like 15, 20 minutes going around and destroying it in our own way with this mod. And hopefully we'll get rid of as much of the map as we can. Alright, what's next? Never know what's going to come. I like the effects, but do it quicker. I don't, I don't want the cats. I don't want the cats. What's come, what just came on the ground? I thought I saw something. I see part of a tree just landed right over there. Yeah, it's raining blocks. It's actually raining blocks. That is so strange. It reminds me of the tornado mod. Okay, so we're going to go down here, like, in the middle of the square and just open a couple chests. But two, that's got to do something. And I bet you the cats don't survive. Oh, they're not going to look. There's sheep with TNT on them. That is really epic. Are you guys okay? Is that a no? And now it's raining from the other one. So the sheep aren't okay then, I'm guessing. They're, they're suicidal sheep. That's just wrong. Sheep should never feel that way. You know, you got to live a long life and, and prosper. All right, let's go for it. This is the strangest mods versus maps I've ever done before. But a lot of people wanted to see it, and I'm definitely having fun with it. Just very awkward. Come on, let's go for another one. I feel like sometimes it takes a while because what it's doing is actually changing the terrain. Something's blowing up. I don't see any TNT. Everyone's old friend of lords and knights. Oh god, he's gone. Oh, there's withers here. That's what's going on. It's summoned in withers to attack everything. Well, my cat is already gone anyway. It's attacking the mushrooms. That's just mean. Alright, we'll go with two. Do something. There's mushrooms everywhere now. I, I think I just made a forest. A small forest. It looks like everything is growing around me. All right, how do we get out of here? Yeah, it's a it's a really thick forest. Really thick. Oh my god. It's so amazing. How does it do this? How big is this forest? I took up the whole square with one. All right, are we going to keep going here? Yeah, let's keep going. Can we do it further? No. No, we can't go any further than that. Wow, that is so epic though. I'm thinking we should go inside a building again. Oh, it's even on the roof and there's water coming off of it. Look, they're all over the place. It's on top of the buildings. Let's try to get inside one and see what we can do. Alright, so hopefully they're all detailed. Because I only saw that one so far. <laughs> it's all filled with trees. Okay, so that, that's, that's not a good way to go. Yeah, all the buildings are actually filled with trees over here. Which kind of ruins that. Anything beyond this. All right, guys, this is not the most detailed area in the world, is it? I thought there was super detailed. We're going to destroy it anyway. Plenty of room for destruction. <laughs> Let's do this. Do something cool, chest. That's cool. I, I like pigs. Could go for some bacon. Please don't light them on fire. Why do you have to change it to night? I had it set, too. All right, fine. Back to daytime. I want you guys to be able to see as we do this. <laughs> we got pig men around. It's really weird. Like a grave? That is very creepy. Yeah, whenever they affect an area, it's literally like the whole area. Alright guys, I found a really cool area over here. And we are going to destroy this bridge. And then that amazing building in front of us. It's going to be... Hello? <laughs> Scare the hell out of me. Was that the wither? Alright, let's do it. Do something cool. Should I get a second? A friend of that chest? Food. That's really going to... Oh, food and TNT. Don't make Steve's droid mad. Oh my god. <laughs> A bunch of suicidal, um, you know, snow golems. No, oh, it's all made of bedrock. What am I doing here? What am I doing? The only way we could destroy it, guys, is if it changed the blocks to, like, you know, a forest or something. So hopefully this place is different. It's, like, completely made of glass. That's cool. Let's go for it. Let's go with two. I feel like when I put two down, it guarantees success with this. I swear, I could have fun doing this, like, for hours. It's different every single time I open one. I've got ocelots that are riding each other. That's that's normal. What did the other one do? I had to do something. Come on, let's do it again. Do something cool. Change it into a different biome or something. Please. 
Is it th it's throwing wolves and chickens out of it. The one and only outcast. Did you just put effects on me? Oh god. Oh, that's bad. It's doing bad things to us. Alright, let's go for it again. Let's get a couple more. I have so many pets. I wasn't expecting this. Alright, here we go. Something's happening. There's like a forest dirt thing going on. It's definitely changing the terrain a lot. A really lot. There's like floating dirt trees. Actually, it's a tree on dirt. This is really weird. Alright, let's check it out, guys. I think we got rid of this place. We didn't really get rid of it. The thing about this, guys, it doesn't destroy it. Well, it kind of does. It wrecks it in a different way. In a very, very strange way. Like, check this out. It's all floating trees around here. Was this obsidian part? I mean, was this um, lapis part of the build? Or did I make this? I must have made this thing. Because it looks really weird. Alright, this looks cool over here. Let's change it back to day once again. It keeps switching on us because some of these boxes actually change the time. Oh, come on, guys. Are you sure it's safe? Are you sure it's safe to open the box next to you? Is that what you want? All right, I'm backing up. I gotta go quick. Yeah, if you don't move quick for that one, guys. That oh, God, it follows you. <laughs> it follows you. Get me out of this thing. Oh, my God, that is so cool. So yeah, it actually follows you and tries to trap you in it and puts lava on you. You know it'd be awesome if it can switch you into survival if you're in creative. That'd be hilarious. It'd be funny if I actually died. Alright, let's do it. Let's go let's go three. Three is is the win. Here comes a forest. And I'll stay here. Oh! We're getting something else out of it too. Oh, I like this one. I've seen this one before. It has lots of cakes around. Let's see if we can get out of here. Because I know as we walk through, sometimes it kind of, like, extends with you. Wow, I even changed the stuff to ore. It's kind of like a little snow forest, actually. It's definitely very cool looking. Definitely my favorite part is to check out all these different builds. So let's see what we can find. Yeah, we haven't been in this direction. That is amazing looking. Wow, it must have taken a really long time to build this. Should we head inside? There's, like, zombies up there. All right, let's go in. Let's check it out. Wow, this is a weird looking place. All right, we'll get right in the middle. It's, oh my God, that's amazing. Let's open some. We'll go with two. It deserves more than one because it's so cool looking. Oh, is that bad? It doesn't look good. They ruined the floor and they made a weird totem pole. That That's probably not a totem pole. It's got TNT. Should I just get some flint? Flint steel here? I feel like I should. If it's going to put TNT, I kind of have to just go with it. Gotta roll with it, guys. Let's do it. And that's not gonna do very much, I know. But while it's doing that, let's open another chest. I felt like I had to blow that up. Do something cool. You have three chances to ruin this place. I feel like I I feel like I'm getting a potion effect and it's not good. Please, please don't do this to me. Yeah, this place looks amazing though, doesn't it? Another cat. I'm getting so many cats. Here came the, like, the mushrooms are here again. It's so insane. All right, three more. Oh, the TNT. Perfect. The mushrooms. Oh, everything is floating. We're all floating. That is very weird. There's a charged creeper over there. All right, let's do that again. The wither's around. This is not good, guys. All right, do something cool. Go come on, chest. You can do it. Break this place. There's a dancing mushroom in the background. He, he might be excited. He likes this, sort of. I don't understand how he could. All right, so maybe we should get out of here. The wither is bothering me. It's very mean. All right, what does this lead to, anyway? Let's check it out. Yeah, it's never-ending, guys. This map is absolutely massive. There's a cool hot air balloon. Okay, there's plenty of room around here. Let's take... All right, I'm going to go crazy this time. One, two, three, four, five. Because I haven't had too much lag. Only a couple lag spikes. So hopefully this won't, like, blow up Minecraft. Let's do it, chests. Oh, my God. I am regretting this by the second. I need milk. I have no idea what's going on right now. But it's not good. Okay. 
that is cool. We made like some kind of cool design here and I've got glass surrounding me completely. And there's cakes. Cakes are always win. Let's get out of here. It extended actually. The pumpkins are out here. The endermen are freaking out. All right, looks like there's plenty of room. I'm gonna put down like three. Cats, why do you have to follow me everywhere? You're just gonna die. It's too dangerous. You have to leave. Tools have fallen down. They I think, oh my god, is it trying to drown me? Get me out of here, quickly. It tried to drown me in a giant bowl of water. There's even squids in there, I can see them. That is crazy. Yeah, that, that's not very nice. Not very nice at all. Heading over here, there's just so many areas. Stop it, I tried to place it down, you got in the way. You're very mean for a cat. Let's go with five more. Alright cats, you're, you're not gonna survive this. I've got a bad feeling about it for you. Oh, not again! Not again! Get me out of this! I can't move! I can't move! There's ice! It's What am I inside right now? I think I might have gotten double trapped. Like, there had to be more than one trap in there. I had to break through so many different things. There's like an ice trap, a glass trap. It's really weird in a chest up here. What is in here? Minecart. That's exactly what I wanted. Thank God. That really means a lot to me. How about up here? Oh, cactus green. I really I really raked it in there. All right, guys. Let's try a few more over here. There's no way we can destroy this. There's just so much all over the place. All right, so five more in the open. And come on, spew out something epic. It doesn't blind me because that's mean. We need a good view. Oh, my God. It's wither skeletons with TNT on their faces. My poor animals. Oh, every animal. All my pets have died. Did you not have TNT? Did they, did they leave you out of the plan? I'm sorry. Would you like a Pandora's box? Would you like one? I got that one specifically for you. Oops. All right, I got both for you. Oh, no, I'm blind again. Why does it have to blind me over and over again? I hate the blinding effect. Even he's blind. I got books. That's exactly what I wanted. As you guys can see, it's nearly impossible to destroy this whole map. So for the finale, we are going to put down 10. I have a feeling it might lag, but we're, we're going to get through this. And something really crazy is probably going to happen, so it should be fun. All right, let's go for 10 at the same time. And back up a little bit. Oh, I see TNT. And a lot of stuff happening. There's a really lot of stuff happening. <laughs> I'm trapped. I can't move. Oh, my God. Someone let me out of here. Is there TNT on my head? I swear I saw TNT on my own head. This is why you don't open 10, guys. You drown and die in TNT. It's not a good thing. Help me, somebody. I can't get out of here. Yeah, I, th I think we, um... think we might have ruined this area. I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but... We definitely did. I got a cookie. I deserve that. That is why we got a huge lag spike, because it totally placed everything everywhere. And it blew me up at the same time, which I thought was a little bit rude. But guys, I think we're going to end it here. I can't go on forever, because I swear we could do this for like two hours, which would probably be a lot of fun for me, though. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and the commentary. If you did, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I will see you next time for another Minecraft video.